I'm Trent Taylor, and you're watching Time 2 Football. How you doing, my man? I'm doing pretty good. How about you? Doing great. Is this a crazy experience that you're witnessing right now? Yeah, pretty wild. Uh, something that I've always grown up paying attention to and uh, finally be a part of it. Uh, even though I'm on IR, uh, it's a pretty cool thing. Yeah, for sure. We're going to get to IR in just a bit, but I want to, to let the fans know at home, because they agree with me, whenever I play Madden, I always make sure whatever team I control, I make a trade for you, because you are a great, great, great player really? in Madden, if utilized the right way. Sweet. What are your thoughts like on that? Uh, I like it. I'm a, I'm a fan of it. Um, yeah, I guess that's that's how I am in real life, too. I guess if you know how to uh, use a guy like me in your offense, I think uh, it can be a, a big weapon for you. So uh, I like it. Love it. Someone that has influenced your game a bit, Wes Welker. What kind of impact has he had on you? Uh, yeah, he's definitely he's had a huge impact. Um, uh, obviously, a guy that I paid attention to growing up. Uh, just being being built like him, you just automatically uh, pay attention to guys like that. And uh, having him as a receivers coach has been uh, amazing. It's helped me tremendously. Um, just learning how to think when you're out there on the field and learning how to react uh, to certain situations. That's the kind of, he has that information that you just can't hear from anybody uh, with the type of experience that he has out there. Um, and everything that he did as an NFL player, it's pretty special. So I just overheard the last interview that you did. We're not going to talk your ear off about IR because I'm pretty sure you're going to get a lot of those questions. But I want to talk a little bit about your mentality because I was overhearing that and I, I was hearing how great, grateful you were for this opportunity just to be in this position, even though you didn't really get a chance to, to play this year. Yeah. Can you go a little bit more on that? Uh, yeah, I'm a big Jesus guy. Um, and what I was saying in the interview earlier, I believe that um, at the end of the day, this is like this is where I'm supposed to be. This is where he's led me to be with the San Francisco 49ers. Uh, I believe I'm in a great situation, and I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be. But um, some plans just got postponed right now, uh, being on IR and missing the whole season. But um, I mean, at the end of the day, I mean. Anybody can take this lesson. You just got to control what you can control. If you're worried about the rest of the BS that's going on in life, uh, then you're going to get caught up worrying about stuff that it won't change if you think about it or not. So, um, I mean, if you sit there and think about all the negative, uh, how people have done you wrong, um, how you're in an unfair situation, uh, then you're just going to stay in that same situation for your whole life. Uh, so I'm not going to let that happen. I'm just going to learn and grow from this and uh, be even better for it next year.